Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com if you haven't already clicked that button and subscribe to our channel on the menu today some beautiful sea bream these have been descoured and cleaned this is a, a yellow thin black sea bream there are many many types um, in fact I think there's hundreds in fact of fish that somehow end up being called a bream uh, so the different type ones I mean usually they're about this size this is about the right size you can see my hand here absolutely beautiful fish we're going to cook these today with ginger lemon and chili they're absolutely wonderful it's a nice meaty beautiful fish i really like bream okay let's go and do it okay so here we go as you can see i've got some silver foil or aluminium foil there and i've just cut the fish can you see just there i've put some slits just just opened it out a little bit get some sort of flavor to get in there now I've got two of these I've got one here one's not in shot so I'm gonna do them both at the same time we're gonna put some salt flip more salt some black pepper Flip them over. I mean, this is so so simple. Right. So we've got salt and pepper on them. Now, I've got some red chili here, which I've chopped roughly. It's going to go in the middle. There's quite a lot there. Pop that inside. I'm doing the other one now. Now I've got some sliced lemons here. What you want to do, put a little bed down, like three slices or something, put the fish on that. What I would do, protect it in the oven. We're also going to put three pieces on the top as well. Now I've got some ginger, which I've finely minced. I've got like a teaspoon here. Again, that goes in. Do this other one as well while we're here. Some soy sauce. Just a little touch. I'm using a dark soy sauce. No need to do it on the other side, just one side now. And of course, some lemon. Let me just cut this. So I've got a whole lemon there. I'm squeezing out all over there. Even the pips, I don't mind them. If you mind them, then you'll have to remove them. They don't bother me at all. Let me get some lemon on this other guy here next door. We're going to get our three pieces of lemon on the top. And like I say, what that would do that's going to add loads of flavour and kind of protect it it's kind of got a sandwich of, of lemon there and simply we're going to make a parcel of our fish and then we'll just do the other guy so chilli, soy sauce, ginger Lemon, salt and pepper, it's all fantastic. There you go. Right, they're going to go in the oven now for... I mean, I'm going to put them in my oven really like high heat. They're going to go in the middle of my oven for about... I would say about eight to nine minutes. But all ovens are different. I always have a problem explaining to you guys about this. So simple, you can barbecue the, as, as well, you can stick them on a the barbecue. If you're going to do that, I suggest that you double wrap them with the foil. So into my oven, highest heat as I can get it, about, I don't know, yeah, seven, eight, nine minutes like that. They will cook quite quickly, they're quite small. See you when they come out. Okay, and there we have it. Absolutely fantastic. 
They're in my oven, I think, for about nine to ten minutes actually. And I've also we've got an industrial size oven, so it's pretty hot. Our one, you maybe want to do it for a bit longer. Like I say, ovens are very different, but they won't take that long to cook because they're quite a small fish. They're beautifully moist and still. The lemon and the soy sauce wrapped kind of steamed them actually I mean they're not roasted really or kind of baked really they're kind of they steam in that little packet that we made with our aluminium foil they're absolutely delicious you can eat them with anything you like I'm gonna eat them with some nice plain noodles actually I'm gonna have these ones with so sea bream like I said loads of different names for them this is the yellow finned black sea bream and, and hundreds of different names give them a go they're absolutely wonderful. Hope you enjoy it and we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.